Okay, now I'll be talking about a book that I thoroughly enjoyed reading and the reasons why. Alright, well, the book that I recently read actually is called Can't Hurt Me. It's It was authored by David Goggins and it's an autobiography of him. Um, David Goggins, a little background, right? Uh, David Goggins is this um, retired ex-Navy SEAL and, you know, the book itself uh, it it explains all of his struggles and all of his achievements and it's just wonderful right it starts with um it starts with david goggins explaining and describing his very rough background when he was a child his he, he was in a very toxic household his father was incredibly abusive and this led him to not be able to read and write correctly and so he, he just had a lot of struggle growing up but you know one day they they he, him and his mother moved and he had a lot of trouble in school and he he was just he himself considered himself a loser and somebody who was illiterate and stupid but out of nowhere, he, he was just able to achieve so many things. And, you know, I decided to read this book because uh, when I was watching YouTube, a favorite YouTuber of mine made a review on this book. And I thought that I, was, I should give it a shot because you know, the YouTuber that I was watching really seemed that, um, really, it really seemed that he preached the book. Um, anyways, how the book made me think about uh how the book made me think made me think about it a lot is that um the author david goggins just it just feels so real to me you know like i've been into self help books for as long as i can remember every every time i would read a book if it's not non fiction or self help i wouldn't be able to read it because i would find fiction very boring but uh, that w that's in the past. I've enjoyed my fair share of um, fiction books nowadays. However, as said, the it it's just it it just feels different. Um, you know, it, it really the way he writes, the way David Goggins writes, it it really feels like I am experiencing his life from his shoes, and the topics and struggles that he faced really made me think about the book a lot because I, w I would say that they were quite similar to the, the struggles that he faced were quite similar to what I faced and the first chapter of the book hits so hard it, it, I feel that it's so powerful all, like all in all to sum up the first chapter David Goggins basically just says to get rid of your victim mentality and you know Ever since I came back from, uh, I, ever since I came back into Indonesia from Fiji, ever since graduating high school, like I've always had this victim mentality that I'm not able to do things because I'm just not destined to. I'm just not given the opportunity to. And you know, the first chapter of the book really just gets rid of my victim mentality. And um, additionally, right, all the chapters in this book, I'm pretty sure there's. To 11, 11 chapters in total, and each chapter at the end has a challenge for you that um, is there to help you get through things, to um, get through your boundaries and challenges to achieve your goals. And I just think that it's incredibly powerful and lovely as well to have. Now, all in all, I really enjoyed this book because not only is it inspiring, it really just felt different. As I've said previously, other self-help books, you know, they're made by psychologists, authors, all these um, great scientists, and all their substances are based off of research. Like, b beforehand, before I read Can't Hear Me, I was reading Atomic Habits. And, you know, it was a pretty good book. But at times, I feel like the writer wasn't actually preaching. What wasn't actually... um wasn't actually doing what he was preaching because it all sometimes seemed far-fetched at times, you know? Even though it, it was not spineless whatsoever, I mean, the, the backbones to the ideas in Atomic Habits just uh, 
undeniably had like a lot of research but there were just some cases where you know i get the feeling is this guy really doing what he's preaching you know now this isn't the case with the da- uh can't hurt me by david goggins for me because this guy lived through it and he's like the embodiment of in, in my opinion at least i feel like he's the embodiment of discipline and hard work and you know all in all it is just a wonderful book it's incredibly inspiring and since then david goggins has become a true inspiration in my life to be honest